What's up? What's up, y'all? It's Dick Hollywood coming back at you with a little bit with some more game. You know what I'm saying? A little bit more wisdom. <clears throat> Something to think about. Real talk. Check this out. Since Donald Trump came into office, of course, we all know he said about such a division that we got all this bullshit going on right now, right? Okay, now. What is it? What division are they standing on? What side are they standing on? You know what I'm saying? Like, what are you? If, if you're not standing for something, you fall for anything. Okay. So they're not falling for anything. What are they actually standing on? Okay. They're standing on America. They're standing on what they think is their land, what they think is their right as far as the country is concerned. Okay. Peep this. Now, when I say they, I think y'all know who I'm talking about. Trump and them, I think y'all know who I'm talking about. So I'm not even getting ready to, you know what I'm saying? We're not even going to go there because what's understood don't need to be explained. And if a nigga have to explain this to you, then this ain't the channel or this ain't what you need to be looking at. But Trump and them, check this out. They stand on America. They standing on actually something. You see what I'm saying? Everybody else is just standing on principles. Everybody else is standing on rights and, and beliefs. But them, Trump and them, they standing on something kind of tangible. At least that's what they think they standing on. We don't respect it because they ain't really standing on shit. But in their head, that's what they're standing on. So guess what? Us black folks. Black Lives Matter, that's a principle. You know what I'm saying? That's uh that, that's a principle, pretty much. Okay. Are we standing on anything that we feel like is tangible, like something to really stand on, something solid? Like those those people are standing on. They think they have the right to stand on what they're standing on and stand on it strong. Well, guess what? We didn't ask to come over here. So since y'all brought us over here, we deserve just as much as y'all. And if y'all didn't want us to have it, you shouldn't have brought us black ass over here. So now this is my message to the black people. You got to match energy with energy. Yeah, it's okay. I ain't mad at them. And see, now Trump got it to the point where now if somebody holds up the American flag, they're Trump and they're, uh, they're with the mother folks. We're not going to go for that. Black folks don't go for that. Because guess what? That flag... We own half of that flag. So what if we match energy? Now it's flag against flag. The other flag of the Confederate and all that. So what? See, they trying to blend in with the masses and just have the American flag. And, you know what I'm saying? And say, you know, we, we know what they represent and how they represent it. If you ain't stupid, you know how they trying to come. The ones that are the enemies to the black folks represent the land of the United States. So tough, you know who they are. Well, guess what? It's time to match energy with energy. Now it's time to say this is part of ours too. Not, um, you can have the land, but just give us our rights. You know what I'm saying? You can stand on, on that principle, but we stand on this principle, which is only uh, something that's written on paper. Are we going to stand on something solid or stand on paper? Are we going to stand on truth or stand on just some uh, weak ass principles that ain't being met or, you know what I'm saying? All that type of stuff. So this is just my message to black people. Don't get mad when them white folks hold up the American flag. You got the right to hold that shit up too. Even though the Americans and done shit to you in the America and we, we Trump has set it up to the point where if you don't like the American flag, you really a terrorist. 
So now we're going to play into his hands and continue to be like, man, fuck America, fuck America. And then they'll be like, see, that's what we talking about. No, we saying fuck what we really got a right to. What? We got a right to this shit. They chose to leave where they came from. Y'all forced us over here. We could have stayed where we was at. But since y'all forced us over here, we got a right to this motherfucking shit. And we ain't going to let y'all sit up here and talk about this is our shit. This is our shit. Okay, it is your shit, but you brought us over here. The fuck? So come on, man. Now, we're going to stand up for gold, jewelry, diamonds, and cars, and all that shit while these motherfuckers uh, bombarding the Capitol building. They got all fatigues and motherfucking hunting outfits and all that shit. Ain't nobody got no jewelry on. Ain't nobody pulled up in no motherfucking race and none of that shit. That's all we're going to think about. While they really plotting, the plot thickens with them. We don't know nothing about thickening the plot right now. So think about it, y'all. Real talk. This is real talk. Big Hollywood. Holler back at me. Push that like if you really understand what I'm talking about. Don't send me shit. I don't want no money. Hit the like and the subscription button. Holler out. I'm out.